good morning and happy Friday. I feel like it's been a while since I picked up the camera because it probably has been. Normally I vlog Thursdays, but this Thursday, as you probably know if you've been around for a couple weeks, Thursday has become like my um, content day. So that's the day when I film like a couple demos and some game playthroughs for my um, my Keeper CGC channel. I'm trying to multitask here because it's like 12.30 and I just woke up. Um, and I want to film some more demos today, but it's currently Steam Next Fest, um, which means that there's all these amazing demos for all these amazing indie games specifically. <laughs> go up there. There we go. And um, I'm like, a lot of these demos are only gonna be available for Steam Next Fest. Let me record all of them. Not all of them, there's like thousands? There's a lot, there's at least a thousand plus, I think. Um, and so I'm like, okay, we, got, we gotta go. So like, I've been downloading them for a couple days. I think I might've mentioned it. Um, and yesterday I managed to knock out 17. Um, so I think I woke up at like 9.30 and I started recording at 11 and I record it pretty heavily through the end of the night. Um, save like a break to, you know, eat food or talk to Wesley. Oh, I also had a nap, um, because I was tired. Um, I got up, had dinner, touched up my makeup and kept going. Um, so that was what my yesterday looked like it was it was a lot I don't know how many hours of recording I did but like on average I would say it was like half an hour per so like maybe eight to nine hours of recording something like that so anyways that was fun only one of the games just completely was broken two of them kind of one was like completely broken couldn't use it at all um, you were supposed to be able to grab a cloud with like your cursor. Cursor wasn't on the screen. Um, <laughs> and the other one I got to level three and it was broken and I couldn't do anything. It was a puzzle game. But did I find some amazing games? Oh my goodness. There was one, Pineheart, which I already had on my radar um, because I got an email about it. I want to say in December asking if I wanted a copy of it when it comes out and I was like, this looks cute, you can pet dogs, I'm in. <laughs> and so I finally got to play the demo. I tried to play it previously, I downloaded it, but um, the demo ended up not being available. So this was, by the time I got to it, so this was one that I was like, must play, it's important to me. So I played that and it was so good. Like it's one of those games where it's like, mm, the controls feel so smooth and I like it. And it's like non-combat, it's just like going around adventuring, fetch quests and stuff, super cute. And you can pet dogs and there's frogs. Um, another one was Nightstones, which I think I had seen on Kickstarter like a year ago or something, last year maybe, I don't know. Um, but you basically, you go to sleep and you end up in this alternative world the portal breaks, you have to solve the, you have to fix the portal and probably also solve a bunch of other problems. Um, super cute. Again, it's, it's one of those games I call like a zero consequence game where it does have battle, but you don't have health. So if you die, like, it's fine. Um, but that was super cute and super fun and I thoroughly enjoyed it. And it's, the, the premise is you have like these stones that you can touch, you can turn it from day to night and it will unlock other things like here's a bridge that you can only see at night and stuff like that. It was super cool. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I also played one called Dreaming Isles, which was like Stardew Valley, but different. <laughs> it was like, you know, a classic farming sim, except it had cool things like it wasn't your grandpa's farm that you inherited, which is so often the case. You basically end up shipwrecked on this island, you find a house, and then you have like a basement that goes right into like a dungeon scape or a cave, I guess, which was lots of fun. You meet an old man, he's like, yeah, that's my daughter's cave, or my daughter's farm, you can have it. And then he helps you build a ship, and then you can take the ship around to other islands, and there's pirates, and what is sound essentially sounds like sea faring mafia. I was here for it. It was so good. And then this, there's this puzzle game called Shroomtopia, which was wildly good. Um, basically you have water up here that's one color, 
and they have a mushroom over here that's the same color and you have to get the water through these hexagons to the mushroom and get the fertilizer. And then obviously it gets harder because now you've got two mushrooms and it's the same color. Now you have two mushrooms and it's different colors. Now you have five mushrooms and you start with like three colors and so you gotta like mix. And it was really good, I really enjoyed it. And the last one that I put, I had my top five, because I did a top five for yesterday, was Show Me Your Story and it's about a girl who goes to her grandma's and is like learning about what her grandma got up to in the past through puzzles and like unpacking slash a little to the left type puzzles. Um, and etc. It was, it was so good. It was so good. Um, so I was really happy. There were a couple misses for sure um, But that's why we have demos. There's this one game that like seems to have a lot of traction on Twitter and uh, Before I played it even I was like, I don't think that this is a game for me I um, I'm like, but that's why we have demos and then I played it and I was like This is not a game for me <laughs> But that is okay. Anyways I'm gonna finish my week in my bed. I got myself a breakfast drink. Um, also, my mom's boyfriend went to the dollar store yesterday and he <laughs> got me these Ziploc bags because he's like, they're frogs, which I thought was funny. Um, my plan is to put my makeup on now and then hopefully record another two or three demos before stream. Well, before I have to start getting ready for stream later, so. Fingers crossed. Okay, so it's a little, I had work stuff that I had to deal with because I woke up to a work email or a work message. So trying to coordinate and deal with that. And then I, t I scheduled a tweet to go up this morning at like six of like the top five demo games I played yesterday and like tagging all the devs. And so I had like a bunch of stuff to respond to from that. But now we are here. It's just after one. I've had my breakfast drink. I need to take some allergy meds because I am having allergies like crazy. And then it's going to be makeup time. So I should be able to get my makeup done definitely before two and then hopefully get right into um, recording my first demo of the day. I don't know what it's going to be. Um, I'm hoping to get through two, but I have... <laughs> I have this list, it goes on to the next page, and it's demos that I have downloaded already to record, and then I put a pink dot, I think you can see it, I put a pink dot um, beside all the ones that are part of Steam Next Fest, which might go away. The ones that are not part of Steam Next Fest, which means I've had them download it for a while, or there's a good chance they'll still be available, not gonna worry about those until after Steam Next Fest, which is, I think it ends on Monday, does it end at 10? Because my goal is to record a bunch more on Monday, but if it ends at 10, that won't work. Anyways, we'll see. If I don't get to them, it's not the end of the world. And I think some of the demos are available a little bit later, but I gotta shut up and I gotta do my makeup because I still got a lot to do before stream. Alrighty, makeup is done. I think hair can last for at least a video or two. Um, work stuff seems to be relatively taken care of, and now I'm gonna start with my first demo. I think I'm gonna do Critter Crops because um, it looks like super cute. Um, <laughs> there's just, there's so many. Um, maybe I'll start with Hexaria. I don't know. There's just so many. Critter crops. We're going critter crops. I think. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty. We have got three demos recorded, which is amazing. Um, pretty, pretty positive, I would say. One of them was like a room decorating one. I played one yesterday that I absolutely did not vibe with. I don't want to say I hated it, I just really struggled and I was like is it just because I've never played games like this before but I just played this other one, it's called Make Room and it was it was just so nice, it was pleasant and so I'm like maybe I do like games like this. I also played one called Critter Crops which I don't know if there's a glitch in the demo or if it's just as far as you could go but there's a quest that I couldn't seemingly do. Um, I One one thing I know about games is like I don't really notice if the controls are just good but if they feel really smooth, I notice, and if they feel kind of heavy, I notice, and that what that's what it was with that game that I was playing. This was a bit of pain, and then I played like a, a resource management road building game, and there was a little bit of panicking and stress, but it wasn't too bad. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to sneak in one more recording, because um, I was like, oh, I should do three, but that'll make it four, so I'm just gonna try to figure out what I want to record. Um, I'll probably look at my, my list to make sure that I get like a good one, like because I, I have a ton of demos downloaded that aren't part of Steam Next Fest too, so that's why I want to make sure I'm doing the right ones. There's this one called Little Known Galaxy, which is kind of like a farming sim in space. So like that might be fun. That's kind of the one I'm leaning towards. But it's really hard because I played an amazing farming sim yesterday and I'm like... Our expectations are high. Actually, you know what, maybe the Hidden Art of Inkeeping 
I don't know, we'll figure one out and then I will finish for um, recording for the day. I'll probably do my stupid little exercises, put my clothes away, all that kind of fun stuff. Okay, I recorded the fourth demo. I end up going with the um, little known galaxy one, which is really cool because you're like on a ship and you have to build like uh, pots that connect to energy in order to be able to do crops. And then you also have to build solar panels to harvest power to charge those, which I think is really neat. It was super cute. And then it seems like you can go down to different planets and gather resources from there and that you can travel to different ones, which is really cool. I also did my exercising and my arms and my legs are cool. But I missed yesterday because I was like 17 demos that I played yesterday and recorded. Um, so I was glad to get that in with my, I think I did four demos. So that's good, that's 20, 21. I think I, before I start today, I think I still had like 20 on my list, so we still got another like 16 to go. I'm gonna try to record tomorrow at some point, but it's gonna be hard because I have a split shift. And Sunday, I work and then stream, so that's probably not gonna happen. And then Monday is still part of Steam Next Fest. I just don't know, like I said, if it ends at 10 a.m. or not. So if it doesn't, we got all Monday to record before stream. So we're getting there. But now it's time for me to go feed myself because it is quarter after five and I need food. Oof. I am exhausted. I meant to pick up the camera just before stream, but all of a sudden it was stream time. Like literally I started stream and I still had to run to the bathroom, like fill up my drink and pee and stuff. Like I was, I was ill prepared. Um, and then my stream dropped, but only in like the first two and a half minutes and then it just came back and then I never had any issues. So that was nice. Um, I streamed until like two, which I usually try not to do on days when I work because like it's now, um, what time is it? It's now just about three. Um, and I've just finished de-streaming and relaxing. I'm still in my stream clothes. I need to change my pajamas, but I am exhausted. But it was a good day. It was a really good stream too. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, and now I'm gonna sleep. So thanks for watching. Um, tomorrow's gonna be a hectic day for me, so I'm not gonna vlog tomorrow. Be vlogging again soon. I'm, I like to have a bit of a buffer and I do not have one right now. <laughs> like everything that is record it is edit it and is post it which is stressful but I mean like if we have to take a couple days off like it's fine it's not the end of the world I tell myself which is the rational thing but irrationally I'm like it is but it's fine anyways make sure you subscribe here uh, all sorts of fun things this year is gonna be freaking wild um, the next couple months I think too depending on how visa movement goes um, yeah and um, I'll see you in the next one bye